Hey guys, Lee Schaefer here with High Vis LED Lighting, standing in front of Ephrata Fire Company number 15, Lieutenant Williams. And uh, we're standing here in front of Tower 15, right? Yep. Can you tell us a little bit first about the fire company itself, and then we'll talk about the truck. Station 15, um, we run a truck, an engine, um, and then we have a special service unit. And that covers, so what that basically does is, that's a support vehicle for the truck in itself. Um, we also do water rescue and tech rescue out of here. So that's the vehicle we use to tow the boats. Got it. And respond to those calls. So we're standing in front of Tower 15. Yep. It's a 2022 aerial scope? 2022 Seagrave aerial scope. All right. Um, it, we took delivery of it in June, like beginning of June. So in the, uh, in your township, what is the, what type of calls does this go on generally? Um, so this will be out. If it's not in our first due, this is going to be responding to um, every building fire that we get called to. Okay. Um, obviously, if it's in town, if it's our first due, we're going to respond first in our engine. Okay. Because obviously you need water there. Yeah. It's pretty important. Um, but all investigations, uh, we roll the truck first um, in our air, our first due. Okay. Um, med assist calls and stuff like that. Got it. So the side scene lights of their truck, they chose two FireTech mini brows. Both have FireTech combination spot flood optics. So what does the area look like for you guys? Do you have long setbacks, uh, rural area? or is Yeah, so um, once you get outside of town here, the, one of the big problems we have is long farm lanes. Yep. Um, so we actually had a call, the, the night we put this in service, we had a call and the, where the building was and the apparatus that were already there, we ended up having to back down this really dark farm lane. Um, so turn all of our scene lights on and it was like daylight again. Got it. So the reason I say that is because for our fire tech optics, so that's the combination spot flood optics, they chose those for both the side scene lights on this truck. And what that gives them is long distance, the spot optics, and then the flood around the truck. They get nice scene lighting around the truck, that wash the scene light. And that's good for long setbacks, uh, rural type uh, settings uh, that effort it has here. We have both FireTech headlights as well as the brow light, 72 inch with the integrated marker lights. So what would you use this for on a call uh, in your area? Um, actually, the thing, the, especially the brow light, um, in like high dense fog, yep. in dark areas, um, I know like high beams and stuff are usually like, don't use those. This thing like eliminates the fog. Nice. And you can see um, a lot of dark areas in town, um, the headlights, um, by far the best that I've ever used. So, Yeah, and the interesting thing about the FireTech headlights, we talk about this a lot. Uh, so Ephrata has the uh, halo soaked up. They have the normal low beam, which is that moon shape yep. uh, light in the middle. And then they have the two angled lights that are downward and they light up the distance between the front bumper and the bottom of the low beam, giving almost like a scene light on those short run calls. Uh, gives awesome amount of light off to the front. Uh, DOT compliant, obviously and uh, just a really cool uh, option, a really cool truck. We want to thank Ephrata Township and Lieutenant Williams here, showing us Tower 15 a little bit. Uh, Ephrata Fire Company number 15. Thank you a bunch. Thanks for coming We appreciate out. it, yep.